Welcome to the Church of Nebula podcast. My name is Haja Mo, and I'm thrilled to have you here with me today. In this episode, we're diving deep into a topic that's both fascinating and incredibly relevant to our lives, the art of aligning our actions with our desires. It's about ensuring that we're not just wishful thinkers, but active participants in manifesting our dreams. So strap in, and let's embark on this enlightening journey together. Have you ever found yourself wishing for something with all your heart? Perhaps a dream job, a loving relationship, or even financial abundance? But somehow it feels like the universe isn't responding. It's a common frustration, and I've been there too, trust me. But then I stumbled upon something that changed everything. The realization that sometimes our actions contradict our desires. It was like finding a missing piece of the puzzle. Let's break it down further with a story. Picture Maria, a friend of mine who dreamt of being a successful writer. She yearned to publish novels that would captivate readers worldwide. However, despite her desire, she spent her evenings binge-watching series after series, hardly ever writing. It was a classic case of actions and desires not lining up. It wasn't until Maria started dedicating her evenings to writing, attending workshops, and connecting with other writers that the magic happened. Not only did her writing improve drastically, but she also landed a publishing deal for her first novel. Her dream was materializing because her actions finally mirrored her aspirations. This story embodies the essence of today's topic. It demonstrates that merely wanting something isn't enough. Our actions need to resonate with our goals. Think of it as sending a clear signal to the universe or whichever higher power you believe in. If you desire financial freedom but spend recklessly, you're sending mixed signals. To attract abundance, consider adopting the habits of those who've achieved it. Budget wisely, invest, and maybe even start that side hustle you've been pondering. Now let me share another motivational story, this time about Alex who wished to find true love. Alex's approach was to sit at home, hoping love would knock on the door. However, love, much like success, often requires us to take the first step. Once Alex began putting himself out there, attending social events, and even trying online dating, he met Jamie. Their connection was instant, and it was clear that by changing his approach, Alex had opened the door for love to find him. These examples underscore a vital lesson Aligning our actions with our desires is paramount. It's about embodying the change we wish to see. If you dream of a healthier lifestyle, start by making healthier food choices and incorporating exercise into your daily routine. Act as if you're already living that healthy life. It's these consistent actions aligned with our goals that pave the way for our desires to materialize. Remember, the universe is always listening but it's our actions that amplify our requests. It's akin to placing an order and then preparing to receive it. Imagine ordering a delicious meal at a restaurant. You don't just walk out after placing your order. Instead, you wait in anticipation, preparing your table and yourself for the feast to come. That's how we should approach our desires too. In closing, I want to remind you that manifesting your desires into reality is a dance between asking and acting. Be mindful of what you're asking for and ensure your actions don't contradict your requests. Embrace the belief that what you desire is on its way and prepare yourself to receive it. After all, the universe is a generous provider, but it requires us to be active participants in the dance of manifestation. Thank you for joining me today on this deep dive into aligning our desires with our actions. My name is Haja Mo and it's been an absolute pleasure to share these insights and stories with you. Remember, in the Church of Nebula, we believe in the power of our actions to shape our destinies. Until next time, stay inspired and keep taking those steps towards your dreams. Good be and take care.